If the content of the prophecy is negative, it can be negotiated and averted. If the prophecy is positive, you can enforce it and bring it into reality. Now, prophecy for the year 2021. And come say, Oh, man, I think 2021. The world, the world, Eriasi will enjoy peace. Eriasi benga sumjie. My God. But I saw a terrorist attack on America. Now, sumi will do a default don't be our American force. Prophecy number two. Come say, touch me, you know. I saw darkness around the Asante kingdom. Me will suma ane what Asante? I say Asante. Asante ni ni no. Prophecy number three. Let's pray for Tepa traditional area and its king. Prophecy number four. Let's pray for Philippines against West Tsunami ever. Let's pray for America and Paris. Against unnatural disaster. The Lord appeared to me and carried my spirit to Northern America, especially Morocco. I saw a gathering like a stadium. And there was something like a disaster or an earthquake. Let's pray for Morocco. Prophecy number six. The Lord said the Ghanaian security so be tightened. Spiritually, I saw attack on Ghana, our security. But it is preventable. Prophecy number seven. A famous man of God will pass on prophecy number 8 there will be floods I repeat there will be floods that will take human lives properties in upper west upper west upper east upper east Asante region and greater Accra prophecy number 9 the Nigerian vice president. Nigeria, I saw him becoming a president. Prophecy number 10. Let's pray for GJA. Let GJA set up. I saw a fatal attack on one of their members. Prophecy number 11. I saw a popular artist. A popular artist. I saw a well-known gospel artist. Let's pray for Yao Let's pray for Grace Omabo. Yamon Prema Grace Omabo. I saw a young artist. Miu Abayobi officer saying goodbye to Ghana. Oh my Ghana for bye bye. Listen to prophecy number twelve. I said, "Come to to be me." I saw a creeping creature. Miu Abayobi area coming out of the sea of Ghana and Nigeria. Ah, every Ghana, you pull any Ghana, Ghana, Nigeria pull with its little babies crying and garnishing their teeth. I saw on the forehead of the creature hard times. Hard times. I looked further. And basic commodities were on scarcity on the, on the national front. Prophecy number 12 is a serious prophecy. Let's pray for Ghana. Let's pray for Nigeria. I saw again, this is where a lot of you want to hear. Let's pray for our men of God. Uh, I want to swerve. Because my, I want to say from January to the first January to eighth January. Every January day, I did kind of quite plenty. I saw, I saw again. Me will be 
that a fatal accident. From now to 8 January. I'll keep praying. Let's keep praying. I saw both house in Parliament wearing black cloth. Let's pray for the presidency. The presidency. I see a cloud of darkness around it. I saw something happening. And it brought the whole world to a round table again. Again, the Lord took my spirit. And took me to the presidency. With my eyes open. I saw John Muhammad there. You hear me? The Lord said, and I said, the Lord said, everybody say, we should pray pray. for nothing, nothing of a Morocco. Nothing Morocco. And let's pray for nothing America, which is Mexico. Mommy, I'm open, nothing as America. I am Mexico. Beloved, I've seen a lot of things. But I want to. There were some behind the curtains. This year, anybody believing God for the fruit of the womb is conceived. This year, anybody who will stay with God, God said He will bless that person. So may the Lord, I have kept some. Mama said, Papa said, what could be? Yes, my elders spoke to me. Sir, me pay for me kasa. Some will reach out to them. Ebi mono, I say you know me kasa. And I want to tell you. Me pay some catch you. That I want us to go to last year prophecies. Me pay some you call Afra Sam come say no. And watch the prophecies that came to pass. Na yon shed ye me mu. Then I will give the last prophecy. Then I enter. Na come say catch you no. Na me ma ma say matra. Na ya bawu mu. Okay, so let's go to last year prophecy. But you know. God bless you. The book of 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 verse 20. The Bible says, do not despise prophecies. The power of God is real and ever present in our lives. Since time immemorial, the prophet Nigel Gazi has given several prophecies through the inspiration of the Holy Spirit for the nations of the world individuals, businesses, families, and many more. The prophecies you are about to watch are prophecies that were inspired by the power of God for the purpose of edification and the authenticity of God's power at work through the major prophet, Prophet Nigel Gazi. Here are some of such prophecies. <laughs> Before election, I will say, ato Ghana. And we will say that at we ja ato government institution was corruption of a social records. Tell me, I will say, man, we ja ato a government institution, a state institution, a bank. Talk to them. Talk to them. Talk to them. They are Babylon. Talk to them. Ivory Coast, the artisan or bear reggae. Ivory Coast, the one sitting on the throne is going to rake. But it's not the will of God. My own pocket of Intoquanto Quabis. Opposition, I saw a communal coalition on Tuno. But my own supposed to control him. Days after the re-election of President Alassane Ouattara, his supporters take to the streets with a victory dance. But the mood isn't the same among the opposition. Many oppose Ouattara continuing in power, saying his bid for a third term was unconstitutional. While Ivory Coast has a limit of two presidential terms, Ouattara has insisted a new constitution in 2016 allowed him to run again. The homes of key opposition figures have been surrounded by police after some announced a transitional council saying they would prepare for a new election. The government called that an affront to constituted authority.
And I saw Donald Trump crying. I don't know why I saw Donald Trump crying. The Lord took me to America and I saw Donald Trump crying. So let's pray for America. Today, let's hold in Savannah Guthrie in New York, the moment the entire country has been waiting for after a very close race. NBC News now projects that Joe Biden has won the Keystone State, Pennsylvania, and its 20 electoral votes. And that means we can now project that former Vice President Joe Biden has been elected president of the United States. He is president-elect Joseph Robinette Biden at 77 years old. Uh, Chuck, we'll turn to you. This map is... Uh, is uh, a real interesting one, not necessarily the path that anyone thought would have unfolded, but here we are. I saw a political turmoil. Let's pray for Nigeria. Let's pray for West Africa. So let's pray for America. Let's pray for West Africa. Africa. Let's pray for Guinea and Ivory Coast. Especially, I, I see it, I see it very... Uh, uh, Ivory Coast is so close. Ivory Coast is so close. There is going to be an insurgent that will attack. That will attack. So that is it. So let's pray for Africa. Let's pray for Guinea. And let's pray the West Africa state. There's going to be a political. There's going to be a political instability. So let's pray in the name of Jesus. I want to turn to a story we're hearing from a great deal from viewers and listeners in Nigeria. These growing protests. Nigeria's head of police has now ordered his men to stop using force against protesters. He's also ordered the unconditional release of all those arrested during the demonstrations. Let me show you these pictures from Monday. That's police using live ammunition against people demonstrating in Lagos, Nigeria's biggest city. They've also been using powerful water cannons. Amnesty International says at least 10 protesters have been killed so far. And scenes like these from today have also been going on. And it's been happening for a week now. The demonstrators are calling for a notorious police unit known as SARS to be scrapped. It's the special anti-robbery squad and it's widely accused of human rights violations, including torture and extrajudicial killings. These are the type of abuses protesters want to stop. Conakry is burning, although the outcome of Guinea's presidential election is still days away. The prospect of a third presidential term for incumbent Alpha Conde is fueling desperation and fury among supporters of the opposition. I am speaking to the election commission. Alpha Conde has been in power since 2010, instead of Dialo. We, all of Guinea, chose the Union of Democratic Forces of Guinea. That's what Guinea wants. If the UFDG is not elected, Guinea will not be calm. Hear me and hear me. The fathers of the land. I respect every man of God. But every time and a prophet God uses, my record show that this time God is using me to talk to the nation Ghana. I don't care about your biases. Tomorrow, my, I might not be alive. But he should be kind to me. If we make a mistake, I'm a prophet. You are for. I've seen in the time that John Muhammad has won. But they said, even if he win, they will not give it to him. They said, if the NDC is winning, which I've seen they are winning, they should win at the post. Because there is an agenda spiritually the Lord showed me at the presidency that even if John Muhammad win, they will not give it to him. Listen to, don't forget that you can check it on the internet. 2016, I prophesied that Mahama will lose. Yeah. I, will check, I will check it. Yeah. And I prophesied that NBC will lose abysmal in parliament. Listen, this time, NBC is winning majority in parliament. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Georgianda will not go back to parliament. Georgianda will not go back to parliament. And who are the other bats? Amen. Amen. From now to December, <laughs> my name is Prophet Nigel Gaze. <laughs> Listen to me. The Lord showed me and I sensed and picked and perceived. <laughs> I saw something strange which will hit the nation Ghana. Listen to me. 
Something strange will hit the name. I know the specific information, but because of attacks and arrests, I'm trying to minimize it. Let the states pray. From now to December, something that is strange will hit the nation Ghana. May I say over here, my name is Wemu Buye. Now, my sister rather say, as the children say, Adi e ya be e be two or more. Until I'm more more born, pay more man, I'm more pay. Before December seventh general election, my husband ma Adi e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e me di fo nti me ya so na bbc a me hu ka amen let i i saw cloud of darkness me hu mu no ku me sume tan i know the name but i have spoken figuratively me di ni sume kete wo the lord said that president his reign no president again in our constitution can enjoy such a reign Jerry Rawlings led Ghana for two decades first as a military leader and then as an elected president Born in Accra in 1947, his father was a Scottish chemist and his mother a Ghanaian national. Let's come back. Clap your hands onto Jesus. There are lots, 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 lots of that came to pass. Because of time, I want to make it. But again, I said I saw an attack on Northern Africa. I've written a lot of prophecies I've seen. But I've been spoken to not to say some. And I am a listening father. So I want to say that I am seeing not Northern Africa, especially mm-hmm. Morocco. Northern Africa and Kenya, Morocco. I'm seeing Northern America, which is Mexico. New Northern America, I mean Mexico. Let's pray against natural disasters. Yeah, mon pae ma, I say, I say, I apodi ya, I must use By the parliamentary. Prophecy, I gave 19 parliamentary prophecies. Parliamentary, come, say, no, me say, no, me say, my woman could do no. It's only one that failed. John, I could pay the deal, John. John Dumelo. John Dumelo. So, even if I was a doctor, it is a doctor, bro. I am still an excellent doctor. Mm, my doctor, I said, pray with you. Hallelujah. So, let's pray. I'm not a geography student. Me, yeah, geography. I say, it's good. Not America, not whatever, not America, whatever. Said, so yeah. you can get it and put it together. Oh, we to I eat your powers. I'm come to prophesy to you. Be shunk, what? Hallelujah. So we are coming to pray. Yeah, bomb, bomb, into 2021. Or 2021. I take some small money from you. My first, can we we'll do change. communion and anointing service. Be ready to do it. Then we'll go. Yeah, cool. This is going to be a good year. I feel for you and I. But very Twenty twenty. 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 Twenty